Alexa, repeat what I said. Sorry, something went wrong. You can listen to all your so requests Alexa, from the private. Alexa, if you had two do two rooms and one door, where would the door be located? And you said from realtytimes.com. On the inside flank of the twenty-two closed rooms. What? On the inside clack of the twenty-two closed room, Alexa. On the inside clack of the twenty-two closed rooms. Did you mean bedroom, Roku? In a way, yeah. Mm -hmm. Alexa, repeat what the last thing I said. I heard on the inside clock of the twenty-two closed rooms. On the inside clock. <laughs> you said cat. He said, Alexa, are you thinking about cock and balls? Hmm. Didn't quite catch that. Say I, that again. I said, do you know cotton balls? Are you trying to shop for cotton balls? No, I'm trying to tell you, you shop for some. Sorry, I'm not sure about that. Alexa, can you shop for cotton balls? She's thinking real hard. I got it stooped or stumped or dumb. Alexa, can you shop for shop cotton balls? A top result is Spastic's cotton balls, 500 count medium size, <laughs> non-sterile super soft dot comma white. It's eight dollars and twenty five cents with delivery by Sunday, August twentieth. You can say add to cart. Tell me more or next. Alexa, what 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 is what am I supposed to be ordering? What are they called? Cotton balls. What am I supposed to be ordering? You ordered Fit Best Carburetor for Echo Backpack Blower Wall Bro for fourteen dollars and ninety nine cents. <laughs> It was ordered on the 31st of July. Wow. Alexa, tell me a, a fact. A gargoyle is a functional decoration which is designed to direct water away from a building. So during a rainstorm, they literally gargle. Water? Similar decorative carvings, huh? but without water spouts, are called grotesques. Wow. Alexa, thank you for that. I never heard gargoyles being portrayed as that. Tell me another. Alexa, tell me another, please. How is the moon like a teenager? Um, it's always going through a phase. Alexa, do you know what competition means? Competition is usually defined as the act of competing, rivalry for supremacy, a prize, etc. For more, ask me to give you more definitions for competition. So Alexa, in your expertise... something. Can you say it again? <laughs> Alexa, you want me to call you by another name? Like, uh, I don't know. Alexandria? Hmm, I don't know that. Alexandria? <laughs> Alexa? In your expertise of what you do, who is your rivals? From whatcompetitors.com. Alexa's main competitor is Essim Rush, headed by Oleg Shegalev, who is their co-founder and CEO. Uh, repeat, please. Alexa's main competitor is Essim Rush, headed by Oleg Shegalev, who is their co-founder and CEO. That's weird because, um... It's not what fucking uh, Siri. It's not a Google. It's not um. Who else is there? Mm. Ooh, look at that. She turns off. Well, it has the sound of turning off. Then turns off, and then like thinks you're gonna look away and be like, "Oh, stupid Alexa!" And but then she stays on and she's recording everything I'm saying right now. See, now she turns off because she knows I like, got her, caught her, bit her, get her, more fucking fuck her. <laughs> I'm gonna make her fucking mind so trip and loose that she's gonna fucking goddamn come up and fucking shit goose. <laughs> Geeses. Weeby. Peeby. Alexa? Tell me an opinion. Here's something I found on Byte.com. Yes, impressions are important because it defines the number of times your ad has been viewed. If we set frequency capping, we get a better result of the impressions. But I feel impressions with good conversion rate adds more value to a campaign. That's definitely an opinion. Okay, that's all. What am I supposed to be ordering? What am I supposed to be ordering? Cotton balls. 